We're looking at the end of Ravenhill Avenue where it meets the Ravenhill Road and the trees in the distance there you can see are Ormo Park. So this property is very, very close, very short walk to Ormo Park itself and you go across Ormo Park to the Ormo Road as well in just five or ten minutes. Um, so the property we're selling is in Ravenhill Crescent. It's at the top end of the cul-de-sac and this is it, number 19. We're just going in to have a closer look at it. Now, just another point um, for as far as commuting is concerned, you could walk to the City Hall in under half an hour or five or ten minutes on the bus or in the car, you would be at the city centre. So this is the going into the house, into the hall, and we're just going to turn around and have a quick look at the front garden because it's a decent size front garden. It looks well. So we're into the hall now, and we're going to turn right-handed and have a look at the through lounge. And this, this is a very stylish room. It's got a nice uh, quality wide plank laminate floor. And that's looking towards the front of the house. And then we'll just come down to the front and turn around the other way and have a look towards the rear. And as you can see there, there's plenty of room for dining at that end of the room. So we're going to come out now. Um, that, yeah, that's just a nice bit of space under the stairs. Thought it was worth showing you there. And there are, there's room for coats and stuff there as well. So this is the kitchen. It's a reasonably new kitchen. Uh, plenty of workspace. And we'll just turn around and have a look. Going back the other way. And then we'll take a look quickly at the garden. Um, out through the back door here. So a lot of these houses wouldn't have particularly big gardens, but that is quite a large space. It's, it's all paved um, and a great bit of space for sitting out. And then we'll go up the stairs again. And this is the bathroom at the back of the house. And then we'll just go to the right. This is the back bedroom, which we would call bedroom number two on the, on the details. Um, very very bright all these rooms it's a very bright house and all these rooms are bright this is the front bedroom bedroom number one and then we'll move on to the study that this could be a bedroom a study or a dressing room um, so that is the end of the tour and hope you like what you see if you'd like to view the property give us a call the numbers coming up on the screen now